Hi folks, Chris Voss here from thechrisvossshow.com, thechrisvossshow.com. Coming with a blog post I'm really excited about. We review all the latest and coolest social media technology, of course. Be sure to check in daily. But this is called uh, the Pocket X Shot from xshot.com. That's xshot.com. This is a camera extender with a telescoping arm that you can hold a handle and it will telescope out. It will hold a camera, but what's also awesome is it will hold stuff like iPhones. Uh, one of the products we reviewed also from xcase.com is their um, iPhone 4 case. And this is basically a case that's made to hold your iPhone and also give it a uh, tripod screw mount to where you can easily mount it to a tripod. And in this case, if you use the products together, you can, of course, screw the case to the telescoping uh, camera extender from XShot and be able to utilize it. Now this is awesome for being able to take video of yourself if you want to walk around a convention or something and talk or you want to walk and talk you can hold this handle out and uh, or if you want to maybe, I don't know, take higher pictures, telescope over a fence, whatever the case may be this is a great way to do it. So be sure to check out the other review we have on this product and we'll be actually showing you both in action here in a second uh, when we get them out of the box. So you can kind of see how they're utilizing this uh, on the packaging uh, where people are using the video and extending it out beyond where they're at. Let's flip this over and you can get a better picture of how this is being used. So you could use this with your self timer where you can self time uh, photos. So you telescope it away from you take a beautiful shot and you can get more of your background of course too in the shot if you use it in that format. So awesome very cool stuff that they uh, put into this uh, in thought. Uh, let's go ahead and tear open the box. Get a good idea of how this works. Oh, it wasn't a real camera. Who knew? Alright, so here's our telescoping X shot and uh, this thing looks pretty cool. Um, looks like uh, on the top here We've got a place where we can screw this in and uh, screw in pretty much just any camera that has a uh, plug. Looks like we have a thing where we can turn it to take and lock it into place. Looks like we've also got another uh, locking or turning mechanism here. We'll have to see how that works. I suppose that's going to lock and hold that into place there. So, uh, yes, that will take and do that. So that gives you the ability to turn this at different angles. And then if you see here, we not only have a wrist holder, which is good for making sure that you don't drop stuff or you can hang this from things. Uh, there's also a screw point here. So you could also screw this onto some sort of tripod and make it work from there. So what this will do, and it's got a nice handle to it, is it will telescope out and I think we're going to probably go in a range here with this but it goes out quite a bit there it looks like uh, I'm not sure what the length is we'll get a measurement on the length uh, here in a bit but uh, what it will basically take and do is give you a telescoping feature where you can uh, see the whole length of it there in fact let's go ahead and we'll break away so that you can see the whole length of this it looks like it's about it looks like it's going to be about three feet ish, almost three feet. And so essentially, what you'll be able to do with this is take and uh, take and put a mount to it, and then take it from there where you can add on the iPhone case that comes with the other thing. So we'll take and do that. We're going to hook it all up, take it outside, and show you what it looks like. Okay, so now what we've done is this is the case that is, comes with the other product that's from, uh, from uh, xshot.com and this is the case that will basically work with the uh, iPhone 4 and be able to plug it in. So what's nice is we've screwed in the adapter here and what we're going to do we're going to try and do this with one hand. What you do is you basically slide that in it will lock in. Now it will lock in two different ways which is really cool. You can lock it in from this side or you can lock it in from the base. And essentially there you have it. You'll go ahead and take it and uh, then from there of course you can extend it. But you can see here that I could easily videotape myself with the front camera. I could also videotape myself from the back camera if I want to angle it that way. Uh, pretty freaking cool. So let's go ahead and extend this and uh, we'll pull it out so you can kind of see how this would look with the whole iPhone extended. And 
yeah, as you can see, I could easily hold this and videotape myself and all that good stuff. It is 30.5 inches long that it will take and extend. So we're going to go outside and we're going to check it out. Okay, so now we've got it attached. We're using it. It's uh, 30.5 inches that it goes out. And uh, this is pretty freaking cool. Um, one thing you want to do is uh, you want to lock in your landscape mode or your portrait mode. Because one thing I noticed is when I was turning and playing with it on a prior test video, it was turning the video and screwing up what I was trying to do. So you definitely want to lock in your landscape or portrait if you're going to be moving this around. But as you can see, it's really cool where I can move it around to what I want to take and do. And uh, if I was at the beach or someplace where there was a background that I wanted to share with you, this would be really awesome to take and do this. Um, so I love this. I, it's almost like having a cameraman who's with you. And uh, you've probably seen this done with a lot of different things. But really neat. And, you know, I mean, if I want to maybe go see what's on my roof. See what's on the roof? I don't know. So uh, you, can, you can even point this around corners, maybe over fences. Uh, maybe it can be a, uh, a uh, I don't know, a toy that you can take and use to spy on people or something. I don't know. But uh, I really love the product. I think it's freaking awesome. So be sure to check it out. It's at xshot.com. That's xshot.com. I think this is awesome for video bloggers, especially if you're using scenery as a video blog. You could, of course, probably do self-timing shots. There's probably some apps where you could do self-timing where it would turn on the video so you wouldn't have to have that opening of me clicking it, et cetera, et cetera. But thanks for coming by the ChrisVossShow.com. Be sure to check back often and watch for videos I'm going to be making using this wonderful, cool toy from XShot. Thanks for coming by. Bye-bye.